Good morning, folks. We've got a couple items to hit today, things to watch on the sun, another paper on pre-seismic anomalies, new shots from the James Webb Telescope, and your chance to see the Big Burb in person. We are starting with the last 24 hours on our star, and we find a mostly calm day, except for one violent surge near the incoming limb. The burst came with an M-class solar flare and is indicative of why this incoming region needs to be closely monitored. The incoming active regions and sunspots will be facing Earth towards the end of the week, and eruption watch is in effect. The massive plasma filament is also turning through Earth-facing longitudes today, and it has remained very stable, which is good considering it's nearly a million kilometers long from end to curving end. Up first in the articles is one on the terrible earthquake in Turkey earlier this year. Data has now shown. It had the exact same kind of ionospheric anomalies that precede nearly every large earthquake. These were critical frequency variations starting eight days before the earthquake struck. Next we go to James Webb, where it scoped the heart of the Orion Nebula in both long wave and in shortwave views. This is one of the most awesome things about the satellite and how its eyes can see so much of what ours can't see and how the different wavelengths can look so different. Last article today complements last night's special video. If you missed it, we went over all the ways in which the sun is ignored in the climate realm, and we complement that today with an excellent paper on how CO2 sensitivity is much lower than most modelers expect. Well, how is that possible with the current state of the atmosphere? Think about what we said last night, because the most impactful aspects of the sun and increased input due to Earth's weakening magnetic field are completely ignored by the models. Folks, on October 14th, we'll have the finished Big Burb disaster vehicle at our next event. It's EMP proof if you haven't heard, and we'll be doing a meet and greet here in the springs. Again, that's October 14th. Come see the Big Burb. Tickets are available at the link below the video. We greatly appreciate your support. We'll do this all again tomorrow, right here, but right now at 6.30 a.m. in the new Valley of the Sun. Eyes open, no fear. Be safe, everyone.